thing I would say is that what makes a good password is that it's not a word. Um, if you are using a word or even, you know, a couple of words uh, together, it's too easy for somebody to guess it uh, using a, a large dictionary of terms and an automated script or something. It's called brute force guessing of a password. Um, and <clears throat> so, uh, so really the uh, general consensus is that a uh, secure password should really be considered to be a passphrase these days. Uh, it, this has a number of advantages, uh, one of which is that they're often easier to remember than the password. Um, people typically think of a good password as being something with complexity, meaning they're a mixture of uh, uppercase and lowercase characters and maybe some special characters and some numbers and things like that. And so if you don't want it to be a dictionary word and you want the complexity, uh, you're left with you know seven or eight characters of gibberish, which is almost, almost impossible to remember. And so if you can't remember your password, what do you do with it? That's when we get the uh, post-it notes with the password written on them, pasted to the monitor underneath the keyboard or something like that, and we want to avoid that as well. Um, so uh, so a, a passphrase, uh, something that is humorous and meaningful to you, um, can help to, uh, to make a strong authentication credential. And, and the way to think of this is that uh, the password is there to authenticate you, to prove that you are who you say you are, because it's a thing that only you know. So if you think of a password as like uh, some other form of authentication, say a driver's license, they don't print driver's licenses on post-it notes that anybody could copy. So if you make your password just the word password, anybody can copy that. It doesn't really differentiate you from somebody else. So uh, when we create a form of authentication in the real world, the physical world, like a driver's license, it often has a watermark and there's a picture and it's printed on special paper and it has holograms and you know all kinds of fun things on it. So that's what we're striving for in the wor world of passphrases is to make something that really is meaningful and authenticates you specifically as much as possible.